question. So Miguel, what is your take on why homelessness is so widespread in King County? Not just Seattle. I want to remind everybody, but King yeah. County as a whole. From my, my opinion, <clears throat> being a, a Hispanic Puerto Rican who's Muslim, um, just like my, this young man and, uh, asked and Kamali answered, I was part of the problem that was what was going on. Um, I've been homeless since I was 15 years old, came from New York, uh, got arrested for low-level drug offenses, nothing major, spent 22 years of my life and 10 months in the Department of Corrections in Washington State. Um, and I just got my own apartment July. Okay, so, you know, um, with that being said, with that being said, it's hard. It's hard, and people don't see what's really going on. And as far as uh, hip hop and hooraying and, and saying this, that, and the other thing, we really have to make a move and see that something that is broken that can't be fixed, you have to move on and do something better. You have to do something better because if you don't, it's just gonna get worse. And the rich are gonna get richer and the poor are gonna get poor. You know, and, um, and it's a shame that in, in King County alone, last year, 2017, we had 10,000 homelessness people, people that are homeless, 10,000. Out of those 10,000 people that were homeless, 198 passed away. 7% of those 198 people were people who were 19 to 27 years old. And those who were, who passed away, who had illnesses, had illnesses that were bypassed because they were homeless. And I speak on a friend who had an abscess in his heart and they bypassed that, didn't look at it, sent them home and he died in his tent. So it's a shame. And we have to wake up. We have to wake up, we have to do something about it, not just be about it, but not for every cause, there's a B cause. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Thank you.